Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Nahi, your friend. You're watching Vita Mind. How have you been doing, my lovely Aquarius? I hope you're well wherever you are and Happy New Year. Whew, it's finally Saturday here, so after I do this short mini reading, I'm thinking of walking my puppy love outside because it's a sunny day today. Okay, so uh, let's begin with this traumatic healing day for my lovely Aquarius. I did the shuffle. Okay, I'm not gonna take this. Okay, I'm sorry. I feel awkward. It's been a while for me to start shuffling. Okay, what do we have? Sacred space. You need sacred space right now, Aquarius. Sacred space. Physical space or emotional space, both or both emotional and physical environment should be cleared. You know to focus on your thing to focus on your inner journey to focus on your life purpose you need to clear up the negative energy surrounding yourself so if you have enough time why don't you clear up the clear up your sweet home you know if there is any uh thing that reminds you of past hurt it's time to take that into a recycling center okay another one is self-love my lovely aquarius self-love is needed right now what happened to you you feel a little bit down and depressed right you have been undergoing a lot of this a lot of traumatic things or something happened right so you may be crying still right now metaphorically speaking but the universe and angel said, it's time to take care of yourself. It's time to love yourself. It's time to hug yourself firmly. Okay, you are the one who should take care of you. Okay, no, there is nobody but you who can truly love you. Okay, Aquarius, self-love is needed. Hmm. Thank you, angel. Please give me more messages for my lovely Aquarius. What do we need to know? Forgiveness. Oh my gosh. I see. I see. For some of you, my lovely Aquarius, you have to forgive and forget. If your current state of emotional state is in the dark, dark night of the soul, the sun is waiting for you to... The sun is waiting for you to release any negative, sad, emotional, uh, hurt, and wound negativity that happened in the past. So that you can come out of the dark to the beautiful sunshine. It's time to forgive and forget. Okay. Let me ask the angel answer card for my lovely Aquarius. It's a little bit deep and uh, profound reading. Angel, please show us what's going on. What's going to happen to my lovely Aquarius? What's going on? Ask your angels, okay? We are asking you, my lovely angels, Aquarius. If you feel like there is nobody who is for you, if, the, if you feel like you are isolated from the world, I know, I can, I can resonate that. I've been there too. Never give up because your guardian angel, your universe guardian angels is always listening to you pray always be around always with you no matter how difficult the situation is so if you have any like sorrow and anger negativity here take a deep breath and meditate and listen to your inner god feeling listen to your intuition and then you will listen to and their messages. Believe it or not, it happens. Yeah. Okay. Give me more messages for my lovely angels. For my lovely Aquarius. The answer is yes. Okay. So, finally. As soon as you forgive and forget, move forward. Because yes is just just the just ultimate positive card from the angel. Yes. Something, I feel like something amazing is coming your way. After you heal yourself from the past hurt, okay? Yes, card. Positive. Improve health, improving health. Mm -hmm. Improving health is 
guaranteed improving health, emotional health, mental health, of course, not just the physical health here. So improving health is guaranteed because you are going to love yourself more with self-love card here because you are going to forgive, forget whatever happened in the past. Okay. And uh, as, as a result of that, you will feel much more powerful and uh, rely, um, how do I say, you feel like after you cry a lot, you know the feeling that if you cry a lot, you feel much better, right? So if you if you feel down, why don't you cry out loudly? You know, that helps. For mental health, of course. What do we have for my lovely... Okay, another card is again forgiveness and... Forgiveness. <clears throat> forgiveness. No matter what happened in the past with your loved ones or with your family members or with your friends, with whomever, it's time to forgive and forget because there is no card, okay? There was a yes card here, right? At the beginning, yes card, and there is no card. So no card here is a little bit tricky card because it can be like, if you feel like, am I, am I... Okay, the question is gonna be like, will there be any, will there be, is there gonna be anybody who was going to harm me? If you ask that kind of negative question, the answer for that is gonna be no. Don't worry about it. Nothing bad will happen to you, my lovely Aquarius, because the first card was yes, the positive card. So yes, no card, it's a little bit tricky card. So, let me ask you another, oh here, another deck for you, yes, no, okay, oh, originality, blaze your own trail, originality, you are such a creative zodiac sign, I know my lovely Aquarius, originality, you are a creative being, you are beautiful just the way you are, never doubt that you are not good enough compared to others you know because every individual has different uh, dna different personality different attribute so never uh never never compare yourself to other people okay you are original right every every negative feedback or every self-pity comes from the thing that you feel like um, I'm not good enough, blah, 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 next person, my friend, my, for example, my Tom has more girlfriends, for example, Tom has more cars, he owns more money, if you start comparing your situation with another one, you will feel inferior, of course, but never do that, because you are good enough, just the way you are, originality, don't forget that, and leadership, okay, finally, Beautiful and a positive yellow card, yellow bright card symbolized here. Set your goal. It's time to, to it's, it is high time to set your goals, my lovely Aquarius. No more self pity party, okay? No more comparing your situation with Anna and other people, okay? Now take care of yourself. Take care of your life. Take the full charge of your life. Set the goals. Move forward just like. The lion, just like the beautiful lady with a torch, okay? You have been going through a lot of dark night of the soul, I know. It's time to move forward to the brighter future, the January. It's already January, mid-January, right? So, go forward. Unicorn invites serendipity. And there is another beautiful unicorn card here for you, my lovely Aquarius. Invite serendipity. So unicorn here symbolizes that anything is possible. You are you are powerful Zodiac. I know. You're very a lot of a lot of uh, famous revolution a lot of people who revolutionized is Aquarius, I know. So even though the current situation may not be satisfactory to you, don't forget that you are a creative being, you are unicorn. You are a dreamer. You are idealistic people. I know. So uh, don't worry about the circumstance. Current circ circumstance will be improved just as you keep dreaming. Okay? Just like a unicorn. 
you are good enough. Don't forget that. Okay, now let's move on to the romance and the card. What's going to happen to you, my lovely Aquarius, in regard to love life? <coughs> okay, two cards. Passion. Okay, oh my gosh, look at the beautiful couple. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. Okay, with who? With your lover. <laughs> Express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. Never suppress your feeling. If you feel that kind of passion in you, never hide the passion away. Okay? You are good enough. Just move just move forward with your loved one. Show your true authentic soft spot for her or for him. You never know what it's gonna happen because if you never express your feeling, what who how can he or she, the other person know? Right, true love. Mm. The couriers, you have true love card here. This is the romance of a lifetime. No matter who you are thinking right now, he or she is just soulmate. I feel that way. Okay, but the soulmate may be different. You have religious factor card here. Your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual past. So here this card means your soulmate may be different. Uh, yeah, I mean, soulmate may be from another country. Different ethnicity, different background, different, different eye color, different skin color. Physical attribute may be different as your uh, usual type. I mean, compared to your usual type, because your soulmate, I mean, even though the different, even though the appearance may be different, no matter how different that is, you, if it is your true romance, true love, it doesn't matter. Appearance doesn't matter as long as you love each other, truly. My lovely Aquarius, oh my gosh. <sighs> Okay, let me shuffle again. The last card for you. Okay, and George, please show us more messages for my lovely Aquarius. Deception. Oh my gosh. Deception card here. Someone is wearing a false mask in this relationship. <coughs> Even though it is true love, you either you or your partner, either you or your uh, romantic partner you are thinking right now, is wearing a false mask. Why? It's time to take take off the mask, my lovely Aquarius. Never suppress your true feeling. Okay? Time is limited. You think that he or she will uh, recognize your true romantic feeling, even though you'd never express that? No, he or she is not magician. He or she is not mind reader. You know, you have to at least... At least you have to give some hint about your love, about your heart, okay? Religion acts. Okay, first of all, past life relationship. So I feel like, I definitely feel like that is, it is your true twin flame is, twin flame soulmate, whatever you, however you name it. Past life relationship, yes, you have known each other before. So somebody that you are thinking right now, you have been dealing with her or dealing with him in the past life it's many many times but first of all to to make the romance i mean to make that life to make the love story blossom into a higher level of commitment first thing is what do we have to do here yeah, you have to release your ex some of you, my lovely Aquarius, you're still dealing with, energetically speaking, you're still dealing with your past lover. This, the time has come to clear your energy, okay? The card says, so my lovely Aquarius, before you move forward with your true, true love, who is your past life relationship, you have to clearly decide whether you will pursue the love or not. You have to release your ex, okay? That's the first thing, okay? Please remember that. You have to release your ex. Clear up the negativity still lingering in your heart so that you can uh, expand your heart to your new love, which is past life relationship, past lover, and past lives, and who is truly your true soulmate, okay? 
okay i hope you enjoyed this reading and um don't forget to subscribe and give me the likes okay all right i'll be back with another reading okay i will enjoy my time here in korea no matter where you are have a wonderful weekend okay i'll be back i love you guys my lovely koreas bye thank you